hello guys in this video i will talk about alert helper in selenium framework right so how we should write a alert helper so that you know it is very easy in the framework to work on the alert which comes alert may be the javascript alert or window alert right so we need to write a logic for that so how do we do that for that uh, what we will do here is uh, in this alert package right we we'll write one alert helper class and click on finish then uh, we need to take the first two line go to alert helper paste it and change the class name to alert helper dot class okay remove the unused import now we'll make the constructor of the class so we can call from the script and we can slice the driver public alert helper and we will supply web driver as an argument and we can write this dot driver is equal to driver you can write here log dot info alert helper is alert hel helper object is created okay now the first method which will write get alert public get alert will write a log log dot info plus driver dot switch to dot alert dot get text okay so this will get us the uh, alert text we are just i'm just writing a log so that you know it is easy for us to know that what was the text of the alert and we can just return here because this method will just get the alert object okay and just it will return to us so you just do return and when you return you here we have to keep return type as a alert because this method is returning alert okay now second method public one second so here we'll write second method which is public void except alert so this is pretty simple except alert what we'll do is we'll call this method and we'll write dot okay so i think we have to first import the alert then only you know we'll be able to call the uh, alert methods of selenium okay okay one second what is this okay first uh, we need to import this this alert okay so when you are writing the alert we need to import from the uh, selenium package the alert class we need to import so import this yeah now dot accept and we can write one log so we can write one log here log dot info 
and we can write except alert is done okay similarly we can write dismiss alert and here we can write dismiss then we can write one more method here get alert text so we can write here public a string because we are going to return get alert text and we can write a string sorry string text is equal to call this method get alert dot get text write a log okay okay so alert text is equal to this and then do return text okay now we can write one more method public boolean is a lot present so we can write in the try okay and we can write here driver dot switch to dot alert if this is there just write log dot info alert is urgent return true in the catch we can write no sorry no alert present exception it comes from selenium e and we can write here log dot info and we can write e dot get coach and then we can do return false okay so this method will check whether the particular alert is present or not so any other method which we can think of here let me think so we can think of uh, accept alert if present one method is accept alert that will go and accept this is accept alert if present accept alert if present
so here we can write if so we can write here if this percent is a lot percent like we are calling this method this will give us true or false right if this is uh, the particular alert percent then we can call there is one method called accept a lot right we can just call this accept a lot else log dot info alert is not urgent now dismiss alert if urgent okay same thing you copy this paste it here then write instead of accept you just write dismiss dismiss alert if urgent so dismiss alert if urgent right so what we have to do here is if this urgent do dismiss alert okay simple and then you write element is not present yeah this will do a dismiss okay and yeah this will do a dismiss this will do accept if present this will do a dismiss now so sometimes what happens is uh, when we have any alert right uh, we need to send the keys I mean we need to send the data to the text and then we need to click on accept so some JavaScript you have a, a alert where first you need to send some text and then you click on ok right so for those kind of alert you can just write one method public void accept prompt so here we have to send the text actually and here uh, we have to write we can write a logic if we can call the same method is alert present so that will give us true or false so we will write if alert present then if this is present then uh, you call for get alert method which we have written on the top and this is stored into a variable called alert so click on this yeah and then do alert dot send keys this text and then you do a lot dot accept right and we can print some log here log dot info we can write a lot text plus text so with this we are done with our alert helper methods now uh, we have all the alert helper methods which is required for the framework so in next video i will talk about some other helpers which is required as a part of your framework thank you guys thank you for watching this